Matt, fight, desire, one special player a point in Wales. Your thoughts on that one, please? Yeah, all of the above. We showed extreme character. Um, the, the place was buzzing here tonight. It really was. Friday night under the lights, howling gale, pouring down with rain. It was all set up for um, them to come away with a victory, I must say. That's how it was set up. And we showed fight, desire, character, uh, especially having going down behind three times in the game. Uh, couldn't get out, quite get our noses in front, which was frustrating. But we showed every bit of that um, uh, and then some quality as well on the end of it at times. I think um, both teams were fighting for everything, uh, giving absolutely everything. Um, I would have liked a bit more control in the game. Um, I would have liked um, uh, maybe a bit more control with our... I will say that, first two goals. Uh, first goal, hell of a strike uh, from Bryn. Um, the second goal, frustrating in a little way because I felt we got a little bit... Um, uh, what's the right word? Got a little bit defensive on a first contact, so we got a little bit deep on it. Um, and then that ricochet then offers out a, a fantastic second finish. Um, and then the third one, I'll have to watch back properly, but um, it, it looked as though uh, you know we've, we've lost the ball in the middle of the pitch and, and then been counted on. So there'll be a hell of a lot to learn from today and this evening. Um, some few times you, what you can't teach is fight, heart, desire, because uh, that comes from within. And, uh, and the lads showed they had that in abundance. Um, and yeah, you said one special player, Freddie has a great day in front of goal, puts a hell of a lot of a shift in. And they all did. They all put a massive shift in. Um, so yeah, we have to go away pleased with the point. Frustrated that we scored three and, and not won the game. Um, uh, and, but as I say, barring two fantastic strikes from them, it was um, uh, yeah, it, it was uh, it was a, in the end a good night, um, and we showed a hell of a lot of character to, to make it that. Freddie Draper will get the plaudits this evening as Isaac did on Saturday, but it just goes to show when you create those chances and when you are you know the dominant team in games that you've got somebody up there when you start with him that's willing to put those chances away. Yeah, well, yeah, we spoke about um, in the build-up to the game, we wanted to get the ball wide, uh, which we did for the first 20 minutes of the game and then slightly came away from it. But we, we saw um, Tom versus their fullback in the opening 20 minutes was a real strength of ours and Freddie scores off the back of that. Um, we didn't probably do that enough after that. Um, and, you know, they readjusted slightly, but that was the, uh, the area that we knew we were going to get joy uh, and we did get joy. Um, I suppose the the key factor into that is we just didn't give us our, uh, to win the game. We didn't give ourselves the opportunity to to get our noses in front, so we were always chasing it. But um, when you do have Freddie, uh, like I say, with the other all the strikers that I have, we give ourselves a chance to go and win games and go and get uh, score goals in games. And you saw that at the end. You know, I had the three of them on up there. Um, Knowles is a right back, and and Liam was back with us as as, as winning as an attacking fullback. So. We went after the game. We didn't want to leave here with anything. And fair play to the group. They've, they've uh, given their absolute all to make sure that, that we left with a point, at least. I was going to say, you threw the proverbial kitchen sink at it. And, you know, Jamil Matt, Danny Johnson both coming on and affecting the game in the right way as well. Yeah, I thought Danny set up Isaac for um, a fantastic through ball that he played behind the back of the defender, which, again, just didn't quite go the way in, at that point, at that key moment, to get that... Yeah, as it would have been an equaliser on the time and then you want to go in and have that hurrah but as I say it's, um, it's a, it will be a fantastic learning experience for us um, it, it's a very very different game from uh, the game that we just had uh, on Saturday last Saturday but we've showed some real other sides to us that you need in this division um, we showed some sides where as I say we were unwilling and unrelenting to, to leave here without a point and um, at least a point so Plenty to be pleased from, plenty to learn from. Um, it's a, you know, we, we, and we keep moving forward. I know Tonoshi McKenzie had to come off at half time. Brandon Comley replacing him, making his 50th appearance for the Saddlers, a great milestone Absolutely. for him. But a, a word on Oshin. Yeah, Oshin felt his groin in the first half, um, so we had to, to make that change. Don't know what it looks like yet, I don't know. Uh, fingers crossed, not too bad. But, uh, uh, you know, I'm fortunate to have Brandon ready and waiting to come on. So, um, Yep, we'll assess Osh and see how he goes. Fantastic for uh, Brandon for his 50th appearance. Um, and uh, yeah, you know, we look forward to many more uh, in a, a Walsall shirt from him. Um, and as I say, we'll assess Osh as the days come on.
And on a final note, 361 in the away end. Most of them drenched at the end of it, but they've been able to walk away from this game, having had moments like that with the group right at the end. Yeah, that, that was special. It was special. Um, as I say, there's something about the evening tonight that it was going to be a topsy-turvy one, and it was. Um, it was going to be a... Uh, you I think you said it, throwing the kitchen sink of it night. It was going to be that. Um, and we gave the supporters um, a good moment at the end. You know, we, we would have loved for it to have been a three-point moment. Of course, we would have done um, the nature of the game as it went and flowed. Um, it ended up being in one of those nights that, uh, that a point feels like a win. Of course, it does. So we're pleased that we gave them that thing to cheer about. Just disappointed that we conceded the goals in the goals. Um, I was going to say in the way that we did. The first goal was a hell of a strike, um, uh, and we just move on to the next game to give hopefully them some more magic moments like that.